Little Pumpkin by Igloo Books and Gisela B. I started as a little seed deep beneath the ground. I began to grow some roots. They wiggled deep down. A shoot appeared and up I went, reaching into the light. Out of my stem a big leaf grew. I giggled with delight. One leaf turned into two and two turned into ten. I felt them flutter in the wind, back and forth again. Soon I felt a little tickle, and then I heard a great big pop. A tiny little bud appeared, with yellow on the top. The little bud grew bigger, and a flower began to sprout. The flower became a small green fruit, a pumpkin now, no doubt. I found I wasn't all alone. There were other pumpkins, too. As each of us turned orange, we cheered and called, Wahoo! I heard a squeal, then a thud, and a girl ran up to me. This is it, the one I want. Mommy, come see. They took me home to decorate. First straw upon my head. After that, a yellow nose and cheeks of rosy red. You're the greatest scarecrow the world has ever seen. She took me to the doorstep. Look, it's Halloween. I saw a purple monster with hairy legs and feet. It stomped its way up to the door and bellowed, Trick or treat! Behind it was an evil witch with a long and pointy nose. Around her swirled a big black cloak, and her shoes had curly toes. A silver robot came clomping into sight, and after that came many more. What a spooky night! Then morning came. They picked me up and brought me back inside. Please, Mommy, can I keep it? My little owner cried. Don't worry, said her mommy. It won't leave you all alone. You can use the seeds inside to grow a pumpkin of your own. They took me to the garden and tucked me underground. Deep beneath the soil, I snuggled safe and sound. But then I felt a little tickle, and I began to grin. I knew that soon I would become a little round Pumpkin. The end. Thanks for listening. Please like and subscribe for more daily stories.